No, the holidays behind us, the so-called triple demic is showing no sign of letting up. More and more kids and adults are coming down with COVID, flu, and RSV. As CBS 2's Nick Calloway reports, patients are flooding into emergency rooms and pharmacies. At Paramus Pharmacy in New Jersey, a steady stream of customers are on the hunt for cold meds and COVID tests. Head congestion and things of that nature. The recent wave of infections and a new COVID variant led pharmacist Manish Pajara to reinstate a mask mandate here. People are confused. They don't know what they have. They have flu or COVID. The trio of nasty viruses, COVID, flu, and RSV, is especially hard on kids. These three have managed to coalesce into one big storm of infection. Dr. David Goldberg is chief of pediatric infectious disease at St. Joseph's Children's Hospital in Patterson. Like most emergency rooms, this one is seeing more kids coming in now than they have in several years. Thankfully, most of them have upper respiratory infections that can be treated at home or they can be treated symptomatically. But we are seeing, as other hospitals are, uh, an increase in patients being admitted because of their respiratory illness. Access Express. The city of Patterson is also trying to get ahead of this surge in cases. The mayor and Department of Health unveiled a new mobile health unit. It'll be used to go out into underserved communities for COVID and flu shots and testing. The city of Patterson spent just more than $400,000 on this truck. The mayor says it's worth it. As he put it, he is doubling down on the tridemic. We have to continue to adapt to this new normal or the now normal. At St. Joseph's Health, doctors say finally cases of flu and RSV are starting to dip, but COVID cases are on the rise. In Patterson, New Jersey, Nick Calloway, CBS 2 News. And these developments do come as the FDA continues to review an application for an antibody that could help prevent RSV in infants. If approved, it could be available to infants and toddlers later this year.